Okay, hello and welcome to this new video. Uh, for my videos here on YouTube, I often have to make small bits of videos and photos for which I use my smartphone's camera. And one problem is how can I transfer those files easily to my computer? And I often used a USB cable in the past. However, you need to find the USB cable connected to a computer, set the appropriate settings on your smartphone and then you can access it. However, for a while now, I'm also using this application, the small app here called Wi-Fi File Transfer Pro. The app comes in two different shapes, the free version, which has some limitations, but you can try it out for free and the pro version, which costs, I think, about one dollar or one euro, which has all the functionality. Basically, what this application does is once you have started it on your smartphone, you get this URL, which you can then enter on your computer and then you have access to your smartphone's internal storage. And as you can see, I'm here connected to my phone here. I get some basic information about my phone, internal storage available. I also see the battery level and I can upload files here and I also can navigate through all the files here in the internal storage of my smartphone, internal storage and also the SD card if you have any SD card in your smartphone. And I can download files and folders here, I can delete folders, I can move stuff around, I can make a zip file out of complete folders, I can create new directories and I also mentioned it that I can upload files here. and. What's very handy is to access, well, the camera folder here. So I just have to click here on the camera folder and I can view the photos here. And uh, if I like to transfer those files to my computer, well, I just use drag and drop. And now I have this file here on my computer and the next one. So it's very easy to transfer files from the smartphone to your computer and I also can manage the files here, for example, delete them here on my smartphone. And as you can see, they are now gone. And basically that's it. Uh, that's an app I really recommend. Um, the app is a little bit outdated uh, because when you start it the first time, it will tell you that it might not be compatible with newer Android versions. However, I have a Google Pixel smartphone with the newest Android version and it works just fine. But I recommend to start with the free version first, the Wi-Fi file transfer. And if it works everything for you, then you can buy the pro version to have all the functionality. Okay, well, that's it.